The African Union Transition Mission in Somalia, ATMIS, is gradually transferring security responsibilities to the Federal Government of Somalia, FGS. The drawdown of the first 2,000 troops took place on 30th of June as part of the transfer of security responsibilities. This was in compliance with the United Nations Security Council Resolution 2628, 22, and 2670, 22. ATMIS adopted a sector-by-sector -sector approach to transfer of security responsibilities by handing over forward operating bases FOBs. On the 15th of January 2023, the first facility to be officially handed over under the phase drawdown plan was Masla. Sa situation géographique a permis à notre contingent de contrôler et de sécuriser la circulation de la population et de leurs biens sur les, les grands axes de désenclavement du pays. Yes. Thank you. The FOB was previously manned by an ATMIS contingent of Burundi National Defense Forces. After Masla, Six other forward operating bases have been handed over by ATMIS to Somali security forces. Many of our partners took a huge risk when they deployed to Somalia over a decade ago. These risks yielded a positive result. Somalia's progress is clear. ATMIS remains to be essential to Somali's progress, and the presence of ATMIS is crucial, is critical at this juncture. As Somalia moves into the next chapter of security ownership across the country. 70 kilometers northeast of Mogadishu is Haji Ali Forward Operating Base in Hirshabale State. The ATMIS commander of Haji Ali, Lieutenant Colonel Richard Bimenyimana, presided over the tactical handover of security responsibility. It is a significant step today by ATMIS. After the, the visit of the FOB, he would like to officially declare the handover of the Ajikari ATMIS FOB to the Somalian National Army. Another FOB that was successfully handed over was Mirtako, also in Hirshabele State. Adali FOB, previously occupied by the Burundi National Defense Forces BNDF in the Hershabele state. And Arbao FOB, manned by the Uganda People's Defense Forces UPDF in the Northwest State, have also been transferred to the Somali National Army. ATMIS completed phase one of the troop drawdown with the transfer of a final two forward operating bases, Gerile and Jubaland, and Al Jazeera One in Mogadishu. We are handing over the FOB to the SSF, but specifically to Juba and Security Forces. You are responsible and accountable.
Al Jazeera One FOB is and has been one of our training centers. It was established to provide training and career development courses to the SSF. Throughout its existence, we have conducted several mentorship courses to include but not limited to EOD, counter IED, and root, root search training. <laughs> At a formal ceremony in Mogadishu, ATMIS senior officials formally signed the land release agreement for all six FOBs, the documents. thus completing the first phase of the drawdown and transfer of security responsibilities. This is a moment of pride for all of us, and we should reflect for a moment on the progress that has been made, particularly by the Somali security forces, who are gradually assuming full security responsibilities. This drawdown represents a significant achievement in our joint efforts to bolster peace and stability in Somalia. ATMIS has successfully implemented the drawdown of 2,000 troops. The objective of uh, the drawdown was to facilitate the gradual transfer of security responsibilities to the Somali security forces. To ensure continued support for the Somali security forces at the FOB's handover, the United Nations Support Office in Somalia, UNSOS, gifted equipment including water treatment plants, generators, spare parts, solar panels, and others. With the handover, at the moment, we are supporting ATMIS with internal movements of its troops and equipment out of the FOBs that are being uh, handed over. And also we are helping them repatriate uh, the troops that are drawing down to their home countries. The transfer of security responsibilities by handing over the forward operating bases is historic for both the African Union Transition Mission in Somalia and the federal government as a country has made remarkable progress and is taking ownership of its security.